Today we are going to Disney Springs and we're gonna eat at City Works. And I think I've told you guys before that I loved it when I ate there. So a little trick about um, parking in the Orange Garage is if you pull in and you park next to the stairway all the way to the right and you just walk down the flights of stairs, you literally walk straight into the security setup. And you don't have to go through that queue line. I thought it was a pretty cool trick. Morgan and I figured that out ourselves. Great news, the balloon is up and that can only mean one thing. Wow. Disney Springs is officially open for the day at 12.46 in the afternoon. Yeah. How cute. All right, Morgan. This was the NBA experience that literally lasted oh. what a year? Yeah. yeah. And I'm still heartbroken about it. I'm going to probably say it every time I walk by it. I still never got to um I float in here. No, basketball. Yeah. The NBA oh, is basketball. Oh. I'm talking I never got to check my vertical leap. That was the word I was looking oh. for. I tried to cut all the fried pieces of my hair off and now I'm seeing on here that I didn't do the best job. And then it's, you know, just regular bar food. And... Wow. No, it, okay, well they got salmon. I never went to a bar and said, can I get a salmon? Although I've never went anywhere and asked for salmon, actually. And then right now they have a thing called Hops for Hope and you order their beer that they have specially made here and they donate two dollars of it's called bottle nectar bottle nectar all throughout october so i mean of course i had to do it i just had to and as someone who is a light beer drinker and not someone who drinks like ipas and all that stuff we're gonna see how it goes you even know oh i can't get it to focus on the seaweed you know they make their straws here out of seaweed morgan told me so I ordered the grilled chicken sandwich again, but I have something really important to show you guys right now. Look at that. Oh, I know what you did. Well, are you impressed or not? No. Oh. I don't think I'm going to like it either. I don't drink drinks like this. But we're gonna try it. It's very strong, but not IPA strong. You two are children. I am not like that. I will never be like that. So I took these really pretty pictures of my mom today out on the patio, and I thought she looked really good today. And um, I thought she would post a nice one on her Instagram, right? So Morgan in the car whispers, you gotta look at this. My mom posts the most blurry picture ever. You can't even see her face or the outfit. Here's the comments. First is me, what is this? Then Lucille says, must be the humidity. And my brother says, get a better camera. What year is this, 1996? You guys just saw all of those nice pictures I took. This is what we got shared. Her Instagram is her name. Follow her for the best content. I'll give you a little peek. Here's a little peek of my mom. I took this picture. And you could tell it's a screenshot. All right, mom, give it a try. I'm already subscribed. You're subscribed to my channel? Thank you. Um, how do I... I knew it, I knew it, I knew it. How do I search on here? Do you search with the little search magnifying glass thing? Talk to me, I can't hear you. What'd you think? You really think so? But you also are a light beer drinker too. Your drink of choice is Miller Lite. What do you think? I like it, because I like heavier beers. Oh, you do? I like like Michelob. So you're a good person to review this. I like it. You would you would get it again. Burn ordered a Bud Light yesterday and poured it. In, so she is not a light beer drinker. No, I like Michelob Ultra. Okay, so you like it. I like it. So there you go. If you are a darker beer drinker, you'll like it. You guys have to watch these videos. This little dog 
literally does That's yoga. Not the same one. No, 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 no. The last video was so cute. But that dog's cute that too. Big nacho. These are the duck nachos. I will not be sampling this today. But Morgan can try them and tell me how they are. Look at this. Look. How do I even go about eating? Look, Very, look. Oh, that's so cute. Look. Oh my gosh. He's balancing on her with his front little toes. Look. He rolls out his mat. He gets the ball out. Oh my goodness. How cute. Oh, look at him. Look. It's like I've never seen a dog. That shot was probably going to go in slow look, motion. Look. Oh, how cute. Oh, do you like them, Morgan? Do you want me to put you in slow motion to your eating with songs? What song do you want? I keep using Celine Dion, but I can use something you want me to use. Christian, do you want a slow-mo clip too? Yeah, they do. Are they good? Yeah, mom? Yeah, good. It's okay, don't worry are the duck nachos here and I will not be trying them because I am not going to eat a duck because I had pet ducks. Oh wait, I had pet cows too when I eat meat. Let me come up with a better excuse than what I just said. I will not be trying the duck nachos because I don't eat duck. I don't think I ever have. And um, there's avocados on that and I don't eat avocados. There's jalapenos. There's a lot of things going on that I just don't touch. But they like it. For the first time in my life, and I want to share it with you guys, I'm going to try an avocado because people are obsessed with these little things. And on my journey of weight loss and trying to get back to the way I looked when I was a teenager, I got to find more things to eat. Oh my god. I've never ate anything so awful in my life. <laughs> oh my god. I had to cut the tape. I was about to spit. I swallowed it like a pill. But I will never do that again. I, if you love avocado, I mean, I'm happy for you, but no. Now we do not like electronics at the table, so we bring games with us to play. And this one is called I Found It. And it's like, okay, so watch. We gotta find teapots. Um, so it's literally just like, what you I don't see a teapot at all. Finding lace. Everybody. The game is over and Christian won by like a landslide. You no, know, he does that with cards. Does he really? Yeah. It's not Working fair, honestly. Cards. Now he's calling me a sore loser. Thank you. I, oh. oh gosh, I can't handle it anymore. This is the cheeseburger. Another cheeseburger, because they're twins. Another cheeseburger. What did we get? Chicken. Now the last time I got this, I loved it so much. I did say no tomatoes, but that's all right. You can pluck them off. And we'll see if I love it again. So how are the burgers? They're, they're pretty dang good. Mom, how's your burger? But no one's saying best burger. My dad makes the best burger. My dad makes the best, your dad makes the best food. How do you like the chicken sandwich? It's okay. Oh dear. For some reason, for some reason, Morgan is obsessed with um, the M&M underwear, and he came back for more. These underwear are super perverted. The blue ones, they get the fun out of the bag. Get the fun out of the bag. And then, who's your candy? I don't think that one's that corny. I mean, it's corny, but I'm the little nutty one. What? What is going on with this world? Anything goes anymore. Uh, yeah, that's true. So we're here in the art of shaving because Morgan needed a few things, but I wanted to shave my mom's arm hair in the sink no, <laughs> just to not. test the product no. for you guys. <laughs> no, <I'm not. laughs> you came with me though. I was like, come here, I need to do something. You're like, okay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> One minute they're playing with Legos, the next minute they're buying perverted boxers at the M&M store. Time flies. And you can get all of these things at the Disney Springs. Welcome to the happiest celebration on earth that ended up being just a regular normal day at the parks. I am in love with this. This is so cute. Oh my gosh, I love this. It is adorable. Last year I bought all four of the flannels, but they're like very thick, so they're very wintry only. This is adorable. The Halloween merch is, I, I say it every time, so cute this year. I love it so much. Look at this. 
Is it like kind of crop toppy? I can't tell. I think so. Do I need this? No. Am I going to buy it? The line's not too long. Yes, I am. I'm going to carry it with me. The other day at Magic Kingdom, I found these like sweatpants and they had like the skeleton bones on them and then in like the kneecap, it was Mickey shaped and I can't find them anywhere and I wish I would have just bought them. Do you guys remember when the rose gold ears came out? I think it was like six years ago and people were losing their minds over them. I know I said I didn't like the 50th March much, but these socks are where it's at. These are adorable. Oh my gosh. I love these. I wish that I wore socks like that. The lines are crazy long, but I'm gonna try the new mobile checkout. Okay. And then scan another. Applicable discounts, applicable discounts check. Yep. Oh. Done, right? Hey, hey, I think it worked. I think so. That's awesome. And I just showed them this at the exit. This is such a cute bag. This is like the new Dooney and Burke. It has to be new because I've never seen it, unless it's not new. And it's got the Haunted Mansion and everything looks so happy. Look at, oh, look at how happy Spaceship Earth looks. Oh, this is so cute. Not so heavy, but that is like heavy. I own that and they're making fun of it. I guess that's how it feels to watch my videos and have something I make fun of. I wasn't offended at all, actually. Oh boy. I just said, oh my gosh, he's falling already. I just said, um, oh no, I didn't tell everyone on the video that I ended up getting the zero and Bern goes, yeah, because they won't notice the growth growing off your shoulder. And look at, he's falling down already. I can't, Ma! Oh no. And it's funny because this little kid just walked by and he had one on his shoulder and I'm like, yeah, this is what 30 year olds do that are cool and hip. Why are you guys oh, laughing so hard? Please tell me. <laughs> what? Say it. You could probably find that. Marshall. Like, I like this. Let's stop at a big Marshall. She said, I said, don't say goodbye to that Mars. <laughs> Is this what you two are laughing about? I'm really confused. I feel like I don't know. Everything I'm like, I bet you find that at Marshall's. Where'd you get that shirt, Ma? <laughs> Marshall's. I knew it. <laughs> We're in the Christmas tree store and they have a whole bunch of Gracie's in here. This zero has fallen off me four times since I bought it already. I don't even know what I'm doing. He just, every time I... <laughs> he fell off again. He keeps falling off and I said I can't even talk to her about how ridiculous it is. <laughs> 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 Why does he keep falling off? Why do you have it is the better question. <laughs> I'm laughing so hard because Burns like, what is with all this misfit crud in the middle of the Christmas store? And everything, she's, it's like when you're overly tired and everything cracks you up, it's happening right now. These ornaments here actually sing when you click on them and then Burn goes, who would want poor unfortunate souls playing on their Christmas tree? <laughs> you guys are just, you love bashing me. That's okay, because I could dish it right back to you. I know you can. I can't take it. <laughs> My mom goes, I don't know if I'm really into the poke. <laughs> buckets and burn. <laughs> Points to the alien one and goes, no, especially when they look like they're vomiting. <laughs> I'm going to be <laughs> She's like, they have to go through an approval state. And you know how many people looked at that and they ended up approving it. And it's just like when she looked at the rack in the middle of the Christmas store with random pins and stuff and she's like, what is this random rack of crud here in the middle of the store? 
And then another funny thing is when my zero, my zero kept falling off and I'm like, why does he keep falling off? And Vern's like, I really just want to ask her why she even has it. <laughs> or how ridiculous it really is. <laughs> Look at the Gracies. Look at the garbage. Don't do that, people. Gosh. No, like I said, oh my gosh, did I put them on backwards? Yes. I totally did. I was saying, as much as I love Nightmare Before Christmas, I would never make any of these ridiculous purchases. Of yeah, any. look at what you made. You purchased. <laughs> and his tag's just hanging there. <laughs> I have named him Pegasus. You know what we were just talking about? Um, what were you just talking about? No, Burn and I. Yeah. We were down at the other side of, um, un um, not Universal. Um, where are we? <laughs> Downtown Disney. And we were eating at City Works, and she brought up a point that anything that really opens down there is not going to last very long besides House of Blues for the concerts because there's no reason to go down there. No, uh, except uh, for the movie theater, I guess, but she's right. If it's not over here in the really busy, popular area, it's so true. A grown woman, just, oh, Morgan's right in front of me. Morgan, did you see that? What? That woman just walked by and said, I like her zero. No. I'm so sick of you. missed it. I know, we all missed it. <laughs> so I don't know. Was that a siren for touching the fish? I think it is. So I just went over, because we're at Fake Sea World, and I touched the Shamu, and this siren just bla- That was loud! It sounded like a tornado siren. I know, that's what Holy it's crap! No. So, um, I think it's really funny because Morgan and them are young, and I'm- I, And they know all those words like, okay, bet, and okay, no, that's cap. And Burn didn't know what cap meant. So like when the kids came out and they're like, Mom, what's gonna be for breakfast? She's like, all right, cap. <laughs> and she's like, what does that really mean though? And I'm like, it just means you're lying about it. You're making it up. So like throughout this whole trip, I've heard her doing it and I didn't know why she was doing it. I thought it was like an inside joke. So they would be like, um, it would just be something simple. Like, Mom, can you get me ranch for the fries? She'd be like, all right, cap. No, that's not how that works. And then, um, she says yo to Morgan, and he gets so upset. That's so, why I do it. That's why I'm doing it now. So now I'm on board, and he was asking me what the secret tips are to be a galactic hero, because he knows where to go for that. And um, I said, yo, I'm happy to help. And he put the <laughs> emoji up. So we're at the bar at the hotel we're staying at. Everything's going crazy out of nowhere. I don't even know what's going on. We're at the bar. Burns calling me from the bar. There's a man over here telling me that we're his family. They had no real glasses, so I went to the gift shop and tried to surprise Burn and found this little doodad. No. So I went to the gift no, shop. No. And is that Granny? Oh, I can oh, hear her from here. Is that Granny? Yes, it's Granny. Ask Granny if she got my pictures. Did you get more uh, Veronica's pictures? Here, hold on. Oh, no, 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 no. So you got to come change him. Okay, I don't want to disturb anybody, but I wanted to tell her that, you know. Oh, we're good. Okay. I okay. guess we're good with whatever it was. Why? We're good with whatever it was, she said. Here. Oh, yes, yes, yes. Because we talked about Marshalls all day today. But the funniest part about this is that a high-end Lily Pulitzer ends up at Marshalls. The Lily Pulitzer ends up at Marshalls. Yep. And we, we talked about Marshalls all Marshalls. day. That my mom said we could just get it at Marshalls. I love this Lily Pulitzer dress. She goes, you can get it at Marshalls. Why are you wearing that shirt? It looks so good on you. And you're like, yeah, I got it at Marshalls. Marshalls. <laughs> So I was just talking the story one more time about what happened to my mom when I first moved here. We went to Marshall's and we get there and this, I never said this story on vlog. No? And this woman comes up to my mom and just holds on to her and hugs her and she goes, oh baby girl, I knew it was you all along. And I was like, I was like, my face. Yeah. You're my best friend. The problem with exactly. me. Exactly, I wouldn't let go of that hug. The problem with me is that I wear my 
expressions on my face. So if I think something's weird, I'm literally like, and I'm like, like, like you'll know how I'm feeling. And if you say something stupid, I'm gonna go. They're getting on the mind car. That's fun. So, so, so if I don't like you, you will 100% know because I can't keep it together long enough. My face just like morphs. So this woman goes up to my mom and she just grabs her in the middle of Marshalls and holds on to her. And I just moved to Orlando, mind you. So I'm like, who, how do you know each other? And she goes, oh baby girl, I knew it was you all along. And I'm like, I knew it was you all. And my face is like, what are you doing? And then she goes, my mom goes, well, can, uh, how do I know you? She goes, you're the girl from the choir, the church choir. You were singing on Sunday. And I'm like, uh, I had to walk away. Never let me inquire. No. no. <laughs> I had to walk away. Because I was about to pee my pants and laugh in this person's face on accident. Because she really honestly made a mistake. And it wasn't funny for her. But for me, I'm dying because this has happened to my mom. So then... I walk away and my mom goes, oh, I, I, don't, I don't think it was me in the choir. But you know where you might know me from? I like to go to Marshalls a lot, so you may have seen me in one of your local Marshalls. I, I just moved to Florida, but that was my mom's way to try to soothe the situation over. And there's another woman that followed my mom around in the pool one time. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> She's gonna sit her face for that. She oh, followed my mom and she goes, hey lady, my mom's like, yeah. She's like, my daughter lives in this apartment. My mom's like, mine too. She's like, see those things in the sky? They were the jet planes, you know, thing that comes outside of the jet. She goes, those are chemtrails from the government. And I'm like, <laughs> I'm like, don't, where, what apartment is your daughter's? I'm like, what is this? And I get out of the pool and I'm watching this and this woman is just following my mom around, swimming and following my mom. Then this one creepy guy comes up to my mom one day and he goes, what kind of sheets you like to use for you know what? My mom, I'm like, what is, what is, my mom attracts the weird stuff. The reason I'm even talking about this is because some guy just came over and told my mom, we are all family here. It's just bizarre, but the Marshalls thing, I had to tell you guys because it comes we spent the, the, the whole day, we've been you talking about everything at Disney we could borrow at Marshalls. That man with the sheets is like, hey, you know what kind of sheets I like to use for, in front of me. The dog, like what in, my, I the kept, he kept following my mom. These like people just follow my mom. And if you're one of them. Remember when we were buying sunglasses and somebody came up and they were like, 